What up, what up, what up, y'all? It's the one, only problem we fly from my rant today. And uh, today's rant, as promised, we're gonna get to the look on the look offs. Um, I guess in different neighborhoods, different hoods have different terms for what I'm about to describe. Um, before I get into it, all you have to do is hit subscribe on this video, hit the like, hit the notifications bell, and uh, drop a comment. Once you subscribe, liked, and hit notifications, every comment acts as another entry. We'll announce the winner this Saturday. Speaking of Saturdays, I want to thank everyone who came out to uh, the pop-up party. Appreciate y'all. I hope to see you guys this weekend in uh, Minneapolis. Now, let's get to it. And it's funny how these rants are working out where it should just happen. Um, was it six, seven people that supposedly know me look me off, they act like they don't see me. There's how to look off school, right? And the opposite of that head knowledge and knowledge. Uh, white people have a version of it. I see it all the time when you're driving, you do like two fingers, one finger, kind of salute off the steering wheel. It's the same thing. It's just saying, hey, I see you, fellow driver. Don't kill me. Whatever. Um, or hi, or whatever. Um, so, motherfuckers come in the bar. What they don't peep, because I peep, is that they look in. So I realize that who they are before they get in the bar. I adjust my position so I, my back space is something they can't actually see me. But um, I don't know how many motherfuckers are running around with my particular hairstyle and shit like that. So uh, it'd be fairly easy to identify I me mean, if you know who I am, right? Uh, and then the black guy stands the closest to me. Now, a what's up, brother, blah, blah, blah. Like, when I say closest to me, like, in my personal space type shit, so, like, a what's up, brother, blah, 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 would be the appropriate, you know, way to do that. But uh, he generally talks like a bitch and sounds like one, so I'm not surprised he doesn't act like a man or a black woman. Same. Um, the other people that, you know, I would have considered friends or at least associates, all in their own little drunken world, pretend not to see me. The reason why I know they're pretending is because when the first motherfucker looked in, we had any eye contact. Now, anyway, that's a look off. It's when you see someone and they pretend that you don't see their direction or some part of your vision is missing and you're ignoring that person. That's a look off, you know what I'm saying? I'm not passing judgment on them. You have all rights and feelings and ability to ignore me. My problem is that none of y'all did it right. Except the female. Cause she grew up somewhere else where, you know, she's probably done it multiple times in her life. So acting like she doesn't see anyone is not a new process. And the second, here's the danger with look offs, right? When you do a look off, the person you're looking off realizes that you're ignoring them, they're just being rude and unfriendly. The fake friend shit you're on also becomes quite obvious because then the person's like, oh, well, I know they saw me. That's weird. At the lowest level. No, honestly, I don't give a fuck. These motherfuckers never show up to my parties. They're not really influential on in my life. You're not going to see them in the comment box. So I don't really give a fuck. I don't really care to continue a false relationship. Which brings me to the look-ons. Um, look-on is the exact opposite. It normally happens in, like, the form of foreplay between men and women, but it happens all the time, too. You make direct eye contact with them. There's nonverbal language exchange. But it's interesting how people decide when they're gonna acknowledge you, when they're not gonna acknowledge you, when they're gonna make a point to make you feel important, and when they're gonna make a point not to be seen. You forget that most communication is nonverbal, about 80 something percent of it. So you say a lot more with what you don't say than what you do. Much as I should be pissed off now, I really don't give a fuck. Cause I really don't give a fuck about those people. And I appreciate them letting me know how they feel. That's honestly got truth. But that's just my opinion. You know, everyone has their own. Thanks for tuning in. Remember, like, subscribe, comment, and hit that notifications bell to win yourself or enter to win a PS4. Next weekend, next Saturday. And remember, it's always playtime. Something more than just physical. Word. It been a while since you met someone original. Word. You spend your time drinking wine in your living room. All that good pussy can't find the one to give it to. What?